Hey there! If you are enjoying the jokes we create for you, please subscribe to our channel. Let's start the joke of the day. On a beautiful spring day, a couple decides to enjoy their day at the zoo. The wife looks adorable in her cute pink dress with straps, while the husband sticks to his usual jeans and t-shirt. Since it's early, there aren't many people around. As they pass by the ape cages, they come across a huge, hairy gorilla. To their surprise, the gorilla becomes incredibly animated when he sees the wife in her lovely spring dress. He starts jumping and even manages to grab her hand and foot through the cage. In response, the wife playfully hits her chest, further exciting the gorilla. Amused by the situation, the husband suggests that his wife tease the gorilla a little. He tells her to make pouts, shake her butt, and so on. Each action only intensifies the gorilla's excitement, and he starts making incredibly loud squeals. Embracing the mischief, the husband encourages his wife to drop one of the straps of her dress, revealing a bit more skin. The gorilla becomes so worked up that he starts tearing the bars of the cage. Now fully caught up in the moment, the husband suggests another daring move. He tells his wife to lift up her dress slightly, exposing her legs, and pretend to fan herself with it. The gorilla is now completely overwhelmed, doing cartwheels back and forth. At this point, the husband grabs his wife tightly by the arm, swiftly opens the cage, and throws her inside with the gorilla. As he closes the door behind her, he says with a mischievous grin, Now tell him you have a headache! Come on, tell him! Tell him that your head hurts! And you can't do that! Tell him! A chicken farmer went to a local bar, sat next to a woman, and ordered a glass of champagne. The woman perked up and said, How about that? I just ordered a glass of champagne too. What a coincidence, the farmer said. This is a special day for me, I am celebrating. This is a special day for me too, I am also celebrating, said the woman. What a coincidence, said the farmer. As they clinked glasses he added, what are you celebrating? My husband and I have been trying to have a child, and today my gynecologist told me that I am pregnant. What a coincidence, said the man. I'm a chicken farmer and for years all of my hens were infertile, but today they are all laying fertilized eggs. That's great, said the woman, how did your chickens become fertile? I used a different roster, he replied. The woman smiled, clinked his glass, and said, what a coincidence. A woman goes into a store to buy a fishing rod and reel. She doesn't know which one to get, so she just grabs one and goes over to the register. There is a store employee standing there with dark shades on. She says, Excuse me, sir. Can you tell me anything about this rod and reel? He says, Madam, I'm blind, but if you drop it on the counter, I can tell you everything you need to know about it, from the sound that it makes. She didn't believe him, but dropped it on the counter anyway. He said, that's a six-foot graphite rod with a Zebco 202 reel and 10 pounds. It's a good all-around rod and reel, and it's $20. She says, That's amazing that you can tell all that just by the sound of it dropping on the counter. I think it's what I'm looking for, so I'll take it. He walks behind the counter to the register. And in the meantime, the woman farts. At first, she is embarrassed. But then she realizes that there is no way he could tell it was her. Being blind, he wouldn't know that she was the only person around. He rings up the sale and says, That will be $25.50. She says, But didn't you say it was $20? He says, Yes ma'am, the rod and reel are $20, the duck call is $3, and the catfish stink bait is $2.50.